surprise, here's the new bike. God damn, why is it starting to rain? No! So this is the new bike. This is a 2006 Suzuki SV650 uh, base model. I don't know. Oh my God, dude, the rain's coming down so hard. Go, 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 go. What are you doing? Go. Just go. Just go. Ah. 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 Boom. All right, now that we're out of the rain, yeah, this is a 2006 Suzuki SV650. Uh, if you don't know what SV650 is, all right, basically it's got a twin motor instead of an inline four. So we still don't have the inline sound yet, but the twin motor creates a lot of torque. This, this bike is really jerky, has a lot of low end. What is this guy doing? But yeah, like I said, this kind of plays off the Grom, me selling the Grom. Uh, I got this bike really cheap. I've been putting some time and effort into it, trying to get it back to a, the way it was. It's definitely got some problems, some kinks to work out, but... Is that a big ass bug on the radiator? Yuck. But other than that, the bike runs flawless, runs amazing. Um, it's been really fun to ride. Oops, there's some wires poking out. Hey, don't, don't mind that. And now I guess we're stuck in rain for the next 30 minutes. All right, I'll pick this up whenever the rain goes away. But uh, yeah, this is the new motorbike. All right, SV650. It's, uh, I don't, I think, I guess I've already probably said that. Uh, yeah, I don't know, I love it. I've put a lot of work into it, a lot of work to get it ready. Um, still got a good ways to go, but you know what? We're closing in, we're getting closer. We fixed a lot of the major problems. Also, on a whole other note, I just don't understand people who don't take care of their motorcycles, all right? I don't, I, I just don't understand how things like this get in that condition. I mean, this one's not in horrible condition, but there's just some things that are questionable. So again, the SV650 I have is the base model version, which is the naked version. Um, I don't like naked versions, so we're gonna try and find um, one day. We're gonna try and find the, uh, the 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 fairing set. Yeah, we're gonna try to find the fairing set off the uh, S. I should be popping up a picture of that now. But there's an S that has a full fairing set. There's also one that just has like a front cow. But um, I, I like the full fairings. I like the full fairings for sure. But anyway, so far, I think I put maybe 800 miles on this bike, uh, and I've had I've had a great time. I've had, I ain't got no complaints, okay? It's not an inline four, it's not a GSXR, it's not a goddamn CBR, it's not a name brand, brand new motorcycle, blah, 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 but I love it, okay? Being able to work on something, all right, whenever the Grom had zero problems, because I just took care of it, I mean, I, I don't know, I kind of enjoyed working on something, kind of, kind of enjoyed having something that I deem is kind of a project bike to be honest but so before those guys come out talk about inline four all right and how their CBR 600 or their CBR 500 their CBR 400 their CBR 250 blah, 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 blah. we'll just absolutely whack the SV650 come running all right put your money where your mouth is you know what I mean okay because I got a lot of faith in this here motorcycle all right it's pretty quick it's pretty fast zero to 60 in like three seconds Yoink. so of course with something that has a lot of low end and and maybe geared toward low end you're, you're not going to see it a huge top end but i think that the highest i've hit is maybe 120 120-ish and i think uh the listed thing online is about 145. um like i said I don't, I don't trust the motorcycle enough to hit 145 yet but you know we're only 25 miles off so so let's talk about something a little bit important all right the grom um somebody said some douchebag comment about me having to sell the grom my life must be rough or some shit and uh you know what fuck you um but I seen, I, I don't know, I don't think there could have been a better time to make a move from the Grom, alright? Um, and, and that's like, if you're thinking about it in a YouTube way, it's like a lot of people who get the Grom are kind of just passing by, you know what I mean? They're, they're kind of, they're just on the Grom for like 200 miles and then they instantly slap it up on Marketplace. Um, I guess if that makes sense in terms of YouTube that just means like you know I, I don't know people aren't written you know people aren't really coming for the Grom people aren't staying around this is what I'm trying to say I guess so I thought you know so I think having this bike uh, something that's just so random 
uh, and a part of the sport class and something that I like would be great. Oh shit. Like I've liked this bike since the friend, uh, the friend who had it, since he got it. it was, I don't know. I just really like the style of it. And uh, I mean, I'm not really a naked sports bike kind of person, but I am a sports bike kind of person. I think the only remaining question left is if we can do wheelies on this bike, and I think it's going to take a couple mods. To uh, make this bike be able to do that without blowing the fuck up. I've heard a lot of, I've seen a lot of horror stories online about this motorcycle and wheelies. Give me five seconds. I gotta get something to drink from the local water burger. Yourself, do not come to Whataburger on a Sunday. <clears throat> so why should you not come to Whataburger on a Sunday? Uh, because um, if you live in the South, we got a church like every every 500 feet. I love church. I love I love God. I love Jesus. I'm a Christian man, okay? But um after church, these folks are hungry, man. And uh it's just packed out up there. That's all I gotta say. Alright, but uh anyway, uh, I'm sorry for this jumping up video. We're gonna get back on schedule. Started getting out videos, normal videos, not having to explain what this motorcycle is and stuff like that. Uh if you got any questions, you can leave them down below in the comment section below. And uh yeah. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, stick around. Uh, we're going to do a whole bunch of cool shit. We can go a lot further now, now that we're not on the ground. And uh, yeah, I hope all of you have a great day. And uh, thanks for watching.